Hi everyone, Miss Bishop here, and today we are going to be talking about how to add two numbers together. So there are lots of different strategies that you might use in order to add two numbers together. But in third grade, we really focus on one important strategy, and that is the algorithm. Sometimes you might he he hear people say, we're going to stack and solve. This is the fastest and the most accurate way for students to get these answers correct. And so that's the strategy we want them to use. So the first thing we would do when we see a problem like the one here, 276 plus 385, is we would take those numbers and we would stack them up one on top of the other. So I'm going to go ahead and write down that first number, 276. And underneath it, that second number, 385. Five. And as I do this, I'm being very careful to make sure that I stack those numbers right on top of each other, that all of the ones are with the ones, the tens are with the tens, and the hundreds are with the hundreds. Now that I have that stacked up, I'm always going to start in the ones place. That would be this place over here, the furthest to the right. So I'm going to start by adding six plus five. Now, if you can do this mentally, that's the best way to do it. But if you don't have these facts memorized, then it's still okay for third graders to use their fingers and to count on. So six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. So since I got that number 11, I'm going to bring the one in the ones place down and I'm going to regroup the second one over to the tens place. Now I'll add my tens. One plus seven is eight and then eight plus eight. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Same thing, I will regroup. I'll bring the 6 down, and the 1 will go over to my hundreds place. And now I'll add up the hundreds. 1 plus 2 equals 3. 3 plus 3 equals 6. And that will give me my answer of 661. So there you have it. That is how we add two numbers together in third grade.